Welcome to another toy episode. Today we're going to be reviewing the McFarlane Superpowers Bizarro. Now, this figure itself is using the new Superman body, which is pretty nice. I do like that. I'm not too fan. I'm not a big fan of the uh, the actual face itself. Um, I would have preferred a a Clark Kent in just maybe that that gray uh, color, uh, but not completely into a a rock monster like they made him here. They gave them a lot of um, details, intricate details on the face. I mean, that's a full version of Bizarro, but I would have wanted more of just a, a simple Superman in gray with the gray skin. Now, the um, I feel like everybody does this necklace, whether it's DC Direct or Mattel, they've done this type of Bizarro. Now, one thing uh, at the beginning when they did premiere him, the, uh, the S was a regular S, so a lot of people were complaining. I'm so glad they got that right, where the uh, S is backwards, not only in the front, but on the back of the cape. So again, McFarland Toys is listening to the fans. The, uh, the blues are very rich, as well as the uh, reds are very dark. Uh, definitely, the, the cape is short too, it's not too long, which is really awesome. Now the, um, let's go with the articulation, it's gonna be the same. The same as the other uh, figures, head turns around this much, arm goes around this much, and then the legs go up this much, they kick back that much, and then you have your knees to sit down. And the uh, paint apps themselves are, are very crisp. The ass is very clean, I don't have any slop. The only thing I did notice though, that the uh, belt loops are supposed to be red, and which they are, but they are missing back here. They paint it right over and are not red. And it's small things like that where you wish that McFarlane would pay a little more attention to, you know. Uh, but overall, a uh, basic figure. Uh, really cool though. You, you definitely want some more villains. You, we already have a lot of heroes. So it's an excellent pickup for me. Um, let's compare him with other figures. Uh, here he is with Superman in that same body box. So they're going to be the same size. And here he is with uh, Batman. And here he is with the Riddler. So the uh, this is the entire wave right here. So overall, it was a very strong wave. I think a lot of people wanted these figures. Uh, we've been wanting a, a better Superman body for a while. Just like this Batman, it gives you the uh, the Kenner vibes. Um, but the Superman head sculpt, we, we just have to do a little bit better. I'm not too thrilled with it. Uh, Bizarro definitely is awesome. Um, I'm sure McFarlane will will come up with an alternate color. I know that uh, Bizarro eventually started wearing purple, so I'm sure you'll see him down the line. But uh, tell me what you think. Did you guys uh, pick up? Did you pass? Are you uh, waiting to see him in the store in hand? Uh, if you're a collector of the superpowers, uh, you're, you're definitely going to like this wave. Thank you very much. I'll see you on the uh, next toy episodes and please subscribe, comment,